Begin with your feet hips distance apart or wider. Relax your hands by your sides. Bring your palms to your chest, palms facing outward. Push and then bring your hands back to clasp behind you. You can widen your stance and slowly open your chest. Take your gaze up to the sky for a gentle back bend. Hold here for five to ten breaths. Slowly hinge forward from your hips, keeping a slight bend in your knee. Hold here for 10 to 20 breaths. Find movement in your neck if that feels good. Slowly with intention, rise to standing and repeat. Stretch. Clasp your hands behind you. Draw your shoulders back. Look up. With any back bend, it's important to engage your core, even if you're 32 weeks pregnant. This will protect your back. When you're ready, slowly hinge forward from your hips, reaching your hands towards the sky behind you. Keep a slight bend in your knee. Slowly rise to standing. Release your hands. Come to a seat on the floor or your mat and extend your feet out in front of you. Sit up nice and tall. Reach your hands to the sky and fold forward. You might grab your thighs, or if you have more space, reach for your calves. If you have even more space, grab your ankles or your feet. Focus on your breath and stay here for 10 breaths. Rise up and repeat. You might find this time you have more space and can reach forward a little farther. Make sure you can breathe. Come to a seated position and then come onto all fours. Rise up.
up into downward facing dog if that feels good. And then come back down for high plank. And up for upward facing dog. Relax back into child's pose. Because I'm in my third trimester, I find that uh, upward facing dog is not the easiest for me. So I'm going to show you another option. You can rise up onto your knees. And come into camel pose. With your abs engaged, reach your palms to the back of your hips. Draw your shoulders back and look up. This is a very gentle, heart opening back opener. Slowly release. Now we're going to repeat the entire sequence. Really tune into your breath. Slowly rise up. Back to a seat on your mat. For forward fold. Again, if you need to modify, I like to bring my legs a little bit wider than hips distance to allow room for my belly. Gently rise up, come into camel pose, And release. Come down to Shavasana, final resting pose. So lie on your back. Extend your legs out in front of you. Take up space on your mat with your eyes closed. Relax your breathing. You can stay here for as long as you like. The longer the better. When you're ready, roll over onto your right side. Slowly rise up into a seated position. Bring your hands to heart center. 
The light in me honors the light in each and every one of you.